your game controller is not working on your PC, then we know how to fix it. Watch this video till the end and learn how to solve this issue. Hey, you're watching Silicophilic, the home of all tech solutions. Game controllers are very important for gamers. If your gamepad is not working, then most likely your PC is not recognizing the controller. Here we have shown how you can solve this issue. So stick to the end and perform all the solutions as shown. Before we get into the solutions, subscribe to our channel for future tech support. Also. Like this video if it helps you solve this issue. Don't forget to comment your feedback on the solutions or if you are facing any issue while performing them. We also have a Facebook group of troubleshooting experts where you can share your tech issues and get direct help. The link to the group is in the pinned comment. Now let's jump into the solutions. First, you need to check and do some basic stuff and see if it fixes the problem. If they don't work, then we will move to the advanced solutions from method 2. Unplug and plug in the USB cable in a different USB 2.0 port and check if it fixes the problem. Also, if you have plugged in your controller to a USB hub, then remove it and directly plug in your computer. Next, unplug all the other peripherals from your computer. Try plugging the controller in another computer to check if it is working there or not. Try plugging in a computer that has Windows 8 or 7 as many users have reported this problem to only happen on Windows 10. If you have any consoles like PlayStation or Xbox, then try plugging the controller in the console and check if it works. If the controller is not working anywhere, it's likely a hardware malfunctioning and you will have to get a new one. But if it does work on other PCs and consoles, then follow the other solutions. Method 2. Try disabling and then enabling the gamepad driver, which would reinitialize the driver. Press the Windows plus R keys, type devmgmt.msc and press enter. Locate the gamepad driver and right click on it. Click on the disable device option and then click on the yes option. Wait for a minute or so and then right click on it again and select enable device. Restart your PC. Method 3. Next, you can try uninstalling the controller driver and reinstalling it. Open the device manager again and locate the gamepad driver and right click on it. Click on the uninstall device option and then follow as shown. Restart your PC and reconnect the controller if you haven't. Check if the issue is fixed. Method 4. Another thing you can try is disable the auto turn off plugged in devices feature. This feature allows windows to turn off the plugged in devices automatically. Open the device manager again. Look at USB serial bus controllers and expand it. Right click on USB root hub driver and click on properties. Select the power management tab and uncheck the allow the computer to turn off this device to save power box. Click on OK to save the changes. Method 5. The USB selective suspend setting can also lead to this issue as it allows the PC to suspend a USB port to save power. Type power and sleep settings in the Windows search bar and select the top option. Click 
on additional power settings. Next, click on change plan settings next to the selected power plan. Select change advanced power settings. Locate the USB settings option and expand it. Next, expand the USB selective suspend setting and select the disable option. Click on apply and OK to save the changes. So that's it. If this video has helped you in figuring this issue, then give us a like and subscribe to our channel. If the issue isn't resolved from the solutions we have shown here, comment below to let us know and our team will try their best to help you out. Also join our Facebook group for direct tech support. The link to the group is in the pinned comment. Thanks for watching. Silicophilic.